Emotions are states of feelings. We express emotions with nonverbal and we verbal We feel them inside ourselves and we express them as nonverbal and verbal communication. It's principles of emotion. The first one, conflict depends upon enough emotional arousal to get the job done. The second one, emotional events trigger responses. The third, intensity of emotion varies through the conflict pro process. The fourth, we experience emotion as good or bad. And the fifth one, we become emotional because something is at stake or our identity. And then the sixth one is relationships are defined by the kind of emotion expressed. <sighs> okay, I got uh, just a couple of minutes to get this done and I have other things to do. So let's just get started right now. All right, you ready to do this? All right, let's do this. Cool. Hey, Shalisa. Hey. Hey. Um, I may or may not have just hit your dog with my car. You did what? Um, I hit your dog with my car. I'm sorry. Darn. Yeah. Dude, you drunk the last bit of orange juice. I'm sorry, man. I'll go buy some more. All right. All right. <laughs> There, there, young Padawan. It'll all be okay. Yeah. You want a cookie? Hey, it was your week to take out the trash. Uh, let's talk about this. Oh, you want to talk? Okay. Who didn't put down the toilet seat? Who, who drunk all the juice up? Who didn't take the kids to their practice? Hey, you I, didn't pick them up. You. I said I said that I was gonna pay for the orange juice, which I was going to do when I was driving, pulling out of the driveway. I hit the trash cans, which you were supposed to pull out. And excuse me for peeing standing up, cause I'm a dude. I'm done. I don't want to talk about it. Bye. <laughs> I can't talk about this. You're so damn emotional. Going on. So, you know that group presentation we're supposed to be doing? Yeah, I think it's awesome. We're almost done. Yeah, um, I have a few things you can kind of tweak. Um, that last part, maybe you can cut a little bit, and the beginning, maybe you should run it over because you need to work on your acting skills because mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't think it's working I for me. My acting skills are supreme. Um, I don't think so. Oh. We we can we can work on this together and maybe maybe I can be in it more and we can kind of put you out a little bit because I'm I'm trying to get an A and I don't think this is gonna work. I, I maybe I should do it. See, here's the thing. I'm um I'm a C average student. Um it's all I really care about. Um so if you wanna redo it, uh you can just do it yourself. I think I will, okay? <laughs> because this is not working. I, I, I'm an A student. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, go ahead and do it. I mean, if you want to get us an A, cool, but I'm fine with the C. <sighs> fine. So as you can see from our video um, of our six um, of ways of dealing with emotion uh, through conflict, um, those being conflicts depend on, uh, depend upon enough emotional arousal to get the job done. Emotional events trigger the responses. Um, intensity of emotion varies through the conflict process. We experience emotion as good or bad. We become emotional because something is at stake for our identity and relationships are defined by the kind of emotion expressed. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed our video. Um, peace out, Girl Scouts.